semi-finals. Look for the ball. Four seeded players fighting out for the title here at Players Championship 24. What a way to sign off for the Pro Tour action for a few weeks ahead of the World Series down under. Now, Absolutely. none of the guys Absolutely. in action here in the final stages will be involved in the World Series. Is that a testament to the strength and depth of the world of darts right now? It's probably more of a testament to the fact that some of them already left for Australia and New Zealand. However, it's no surprise to see all of these guys in the latter stages of these tournaments. In the other half of the draw on the other streaming board, you can see the European champion Rob Cross taking on Chris Doby, who hasn't been great this year, but last year was absolutely brilliant and consistently brilliant. This year, we've got two of these stars of the year. Luke Humphreys, definitely so. Five titles to his name already, but Martin Schindler continues to make huge strides forward in his career. It is the German number two, but he is the best player from Germany in the world right now against the top seed Luke Humphreys, cool hand Luke, and Chris Murphy's alongside me to see who makes the final. Yeah, and Humphreys kept a cool head against Dimitri Vandenberg in the semi-final, streamed over on the other streaming board. It was a blitz from Vandenberg in the early exchanges, but Humphreys had some good finishes, including a 1-2-1 one, one checkout on the bullseye. Kept himself in the game, and then went on to win the game. Treble 18, and the bull here would see him win the leg. Game shot. And he has won the leg. Well, the 1-2-1 one, one in that one, and a 1-2-2 two, two to start this one. Well, Luke Humphreys has played at a very good level today. In fact, they both have. They're both averaging between 97 and 98 for the day. Schindler has been hitting enormous amounts of 180s, as he tends to do nowadays. He's hit 19 already today. And they've both had one poor game in terms of the averages, which has dragged things down a little. We're not for their poor game where they've averaged in the 60. 80s. And they still won it, remember. Then they'd be averaging over a ton for the day. And that just reflects how consistently good they've been. 180. That is the 13th maximum for... Luke Humphreys today. Schindler had to survive a little bit of a scare in the, the semi-finals. Madras Razma was looking like to snatch victory there. Missed, we think, two darts at double. Could have been one, depending which route he went. It wasn't a streamed game. But Schindler took out a 106 finish in that last leg decider. Well, he's struggling to get to a finish here. Or struggling to get to a position where he gets a go at a finish because Luke Humphreys might be starting off with back-to-back -back four visit legs. Worries the wire. Game Pins shot. the double eight. It's a 12 darter. Magnificent stuff from cool hand Luke. And back to back 180s in that leg as he breaks at the first available opportunity in this race to seven to reach the final. Humphreys the number one seed in this tournament, but not a finalist yet. Hasn't played to seeding despite reaching a quarter final on the opening day. It was a disappointing day for him yesterday, being 45. dumped out in the first round by Carol Sedlacek. Didn't play poorly though, did he? He was just beaten by a good display from Sed Incredible performance. High checkout 147. He hit the bull in the middle of that finish as well. Schindler credits him. He kept sticking around, including that 120 finish to stay in it. But Humphreys was just too hot. He's through to the final. Will he face Rob Cross or Chris Doby? You can find out if you switch over to Stream 2 now. And we'll see you again here on Stream.